What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having an amazing day today. We are here bringing you guys some brand new content on the brand new game that just released for the Nintendo Switch, Splatoon 3. Splatoon is one of those series for the Nintendo franchise that has grown over the years and it's become one of my favorites of all. It's a, what, probably, I should say probably the best multiplayer on Nintendo Switch, but it is one of those games that not a lot of people play. I don't know why. I just don't think people give it a chance but i'm telling you guys it is one of the best games on nintendo switch so guys in today's video i'm going to be giving my first impressions of this brand new splatoon game and going over some battles and just showcasing this game to us fools you guys already know the deal if you do enjoy the content anytime make sure you support me as a content creator by leaving a like on today's video and if you're not subscribed to the channel click that big red subscribe button so you know my videos go live because we're going to be doing guides on splatoon 3 with like the best weapons how to play all that good stuff and we're going to be showcasing how to get more money and everything and just doing ranked battles all across this channel so if you guys want to stay up to date with all my splatoon 3 content make sure you guys hit that subscribe button but like i said today's video is about showcasing this game so we're going to be doing probably like four to five battles depending on how long they take and uh, also going into the shop because there are four different shops in this game and buying some new guns, buying some new clothes, all that good stuff. So we're going to get started here by checking the gun shop right here, the weapon shop, whatever you want to call it. And I don't think I can get anything. Oh, I can get a few new weapons. Okay, that's pretty cool. I can get a few new weapons, so I am going to buy a few new weapons, such as the slasher because slasher is my favorite weapons. And I do not want to use the same weapon for all the battles because they're kind of just like showcasing this game. So we are in the weapon shop. It's called M. It's right here. And I am going to be buying the slasher, which is the bucket. A nice lovely bucket because the bucket is one of my favorite weapons of all especially when in splatoon uh two but in this game they added two new weapons they added uh splatanas which is like a sword katana and then they added bow and arrows which is really really dope so i'm gonna i have one of these and i'm gonna exchange it for this we get the triple ink strike which i never use that's a new thing and we get a splat bomb which is dope and you know what i'm not gonna equip this right now i'm gonna hold it into my uh inventory and we're gonna use it later but we're gonna head over to the different shop and this is where you get gear you have hats pants and shirts and what they actually allow you to do is to give you upgrades in game so they can make you uh recover ink faster do a bit more damage jump a bit higher all that good stuff so uh let me go back to here and i can buy some stuff can i buy anything from him oh no i have to be level four that is whack so i'm stuck using my normal clothes at least i could buy some new guns that's totally fine but yeah i just started playing this game i played a few matches with it maybe like three or four i'm up to level three but once i hit level four i can get grinding we should get level four by the uh, end of today's video definitely should be able to do that but without further ado let's hop into the lobby go over there and start some turf war the turf war is the regular mode in splatoon it is the first mode you can do and the uh, only mode you can do until you unlock rank at like level 10 i believe but it's, it's a pretty cool mode but i really like the uh the loading zone here so you can actually load up a match now and then come over here and do a little bit of practice before you do it but before we actually start our first match i want to go over the weapon that we are using we're going to be using one of the most basic weapons which i absolutely love, is going to be the splatter shot it is decent all around it has decent range decent damage decent fire rate it has suction bombs and the trizuka i'm going to be showcasing the slosh today we're probably not going to be using the splatter shot junior just because i don't really like that weapon and then i think if we level up we can actually use another weapon actually a new weapon so awesome 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 but let's hop into this lobby right here load up a regular battle and just hit yes hopping into our first match for splatoon 3 on the jeans youtube channel Let's get after it. Hopefully we can grab ourselves a win and play, play decently well. Our team's looking pretty good. We have a, what, what is that, a Gatling gun? I dig it. But they have this new spawning system where you have to shoot yourself over. Which is pretty cool. I don't mind it too much. This game just feels a lot better than Splatoon 2, 2 so I cannot wait to like dive deep into this game and get and get to like know everything about it and get every single weapon. Wow, I almost actually fell off the edge. So that's the map. But uh, if you guys want to catch extra Splatoon 3 content, make sure you guys follow me over on my Twitch page, Jeans25 over on Twitch. We're going to be streaming this game a lot, so just hit that link down in the description below and go hit that follow button over there. But I have my Ink Zuka, which I'm going to start shooting, see if I can get a kill off the rip. And do I get anybody? No, we do not get anybody, but we put some pressure on the board. Very nice. I kind of want to push up here because we got these guys. Where does this dude go? That's, what, that's what's crazy about Splatoon. People can be so, like, move really well in this game. Oh, I might be dead. Hope we survive. Nope, now I'm dead. Oh, I'll take a trade. I'll take a trade. Me and this guy trade it. So what a trade means is, like, he kills me, I kill him. It's not too bad. Not too bad, but I'm hoping we can uh, come out of today's video with at least like four wins. I think we're going to do five matches. I think five matches are good because the matches are only like three three minutes long. So if we can get that rolling, that could be awesome. Yeah, if, we, if we get four wins, that'd be beautiful. That'd be beautiful. So we're going to get rolling here. Go this way, go this way, go that way. And I'm just going to keep some pressure on the side here. Put some nades up there. And actually, I don't really like to be on the side there. I'd rather be in the middle to keep pressure, which is a lot better for your team, I feel like. This guy's pushing me a little bit. I got a kill with a... Uh, 
spike your knee, which is gorgeous. And I'm just going to put some pressure with this bazooka and try to shoot it down there and see if I can get him. No, I missed him. Gotta get this dude. There's two dudes back here. There's three. There might be three. I'm going to need there. I ain't going to push that if there's three over there. What is that? Oh, he has a special. Oh, the special coming out there. What is that? A crab tank? A crab tank? I've never seen that. They added a bunch of new specials in Splatoon 3, so... There's gonna be some things that I have no idea what's going on. I was sitting there wondering, like, why am I taking damage? This dude had a crab tank. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. But this game's so hectic and is definitely one of the best multiplayers for, uh... Of course he dropped a special there, dude. I had him dead. I had that dude dead. I'm gonna go protect my teammate. He actually picks up the kill, which is huge. Is there another one? I should have this dude. Of course I missed my shots. Well, I didn't really miss my shots. I'm not gonna lie. My... Our ally dude was kind of blocking me. It was kind of funny. I was kind of just shooting at his back when I had the, my target right on him. But we're keeping a lot of good pressure right now. Oh! I just got hit by something. I hopped in. I'm going to do this. I'm going to put a nade this way. And this guy is going to drop his special. And there should be somebody over here, which I kind of want to go after. Got him. There we go. Take that. And we'll keep the pressure up. So not a bad first match so far. If we can just keep pressure, we'll win this game all day. We will win this game all day. I almost have my special again, which I would love to get one more time. If I put this nade here, I can end with my special. Or should I push up on this guy? There's a nice little kill. And there we go. We got our special. And of course, there's a dude behind me. Can I get the kill on him? Nope. Dude comes behind us. And this one's going to be close. The ink is close. Are we going to win this? I think we are. We have our team chilling there. I think we should be good with the win here. It is looking pretty good. It's looking pretty promising. And let's see how we did in our first match. Usually, you could tell if you won right off the rip. Just by looking at the map. Let's see. And oh, this one's actually really close. Did we win this one? Give us a win. Let's go. Look how close that was. 0.9% we won that match by. And there it is. We get Splatoon 3 started off with a victory, which is absolutely amazing. Let's see how we did it with the stats. I didn't think we did too bad. I usually like to play to win rather than play for kills. But playing for kills is always fun. Definitely is always fun. But let me see them stats. Let me see them stats. Let's see how we did. We had five kills, four deaths, and two specials. That's not too bad for uh, Turf 4. Not too bad for Turf 4. And we are almost leveled up, which means we can actually... uh. Get some new weapons, but I'm going to switch my weapon to the slasher. It is my favorite weapon, and I'm going to show you guys something really cool. It's going to be about the matching system. So when you're waiting, you can legit just like play around and do your thing, which is absolutely amazing. It's really, really cool. But I actually never used this special before, so hopefully I can get this special before the uh, next match starts. <laughs> that we'll actually want to see what it does. It is a tri-ink strike. I'm just going to charge this up. And oh, what's it do? Oh, here we go. Twister time? I just throw it. Oh, no. Battle time. <laughs> battle time. Didn't even get to use it, but I guess we're going to use it in this next battle. I guess we're going to use it in the next battle, but if you guys watch any of my Splatoon 2 content, it was definitely a while ago. I did stream it recently, but this, the, uh, what is it? The slasher, this bucket is actually one of my favorite weapons in Splatoon 2. So hopefully I get rocking with it and I, I get, I get to do good with it. Cause look at it. You can just tuck paint everywhere. It's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing. Look how much paint it puts down. It puts down so much paint. I love it. I love it so much. So here, bang bang, and I'm out of ink, of course. And charge it up. I think somebody on the other team went down this way. I see purple ink. Not a fan of the purple ink. Oh, he's behind us, aren't you? What's this dude doing? Okay, now let's test out this special here. Twister time? Let's throw it. Oh, I get three of them. I get three of them. Oh, they're, that's sick. That is actually a really cool special. It drops three miniature ink strikes. Yo, we just hit him up for some damage. What's up, dude? Of course, he drops his special. That, like, I think that works as like a shield. But that's what's so good about this, uh, where's this dude at? Just kill for us. That's what's so good about this, uh, is that dude coming up here? The sloshers. It just paints so much ink and it's really good for turf war. If I'm looking to win, I kind of like using this, this weapon right here. Is that dude coming behind us? There is. Right over here. I miss him. Okay, I'll trade the kill. I'll trade the kill. Oh, we had our ink strike, but we lost it because we died. Okay, not too bad. There's the ink stamp. The Splatana is such a cool weapon. I really want to try out the new weapons, and I think we're going to try out at least one of them. This so, might be the bow, because I really want to try out the bow. I think the bow is sick, but I got to turf up some ink here. I got to get my special just so we can get some stuff rolling here. E, if I die from that, I'm going to cry a little bit, but I'm going to throw this here, throw this one here, and I'm going to throw this one there. Got some dudes pushing up here. All right, cool. We got to push up. Coming. There we go. Nice little kill. We get some pressure up here. I see another dude right here. Get back here. Gotta get that rolling. These guys got a lot of pressure on us right now. A lot of pressure on us. Wow. I might die here. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm gonna go up here. Get over here. Get up here. They got all the ink on us. They got everything rolling here. Okay, a nice kill by me. 
And this guy's pushing me on this side. Can't do anything here unless I drop these ink strikes. Look at that. Look at that. Do I get anybody with that? I'm chilling here. We somehow escaped this. I don't think we escaped it just yet. I don't know what to do. I am terrified here. I am terrified. I need to get out of here. I cannot get out of here. If I somehow escape this, I'm a god. No way I'm escaping this. Okay, cool. <laughs> I was going to say, there's no way I escaped that. There's no way I escaped that. Wow, we're probably going to lose this one. Unless we get a one last minute push, but I don't know what's going on here. We cannot get anything going here. Go up here. Drop down here. Can you kill this dude? There we go. I got him. Don't worry. I'm dead here. Yep, that grenade was perfect. That grenade was perfect. It was perfection. It was perfection. But they, I love Splatoon. It's just such a fun game. It really is. You can play it for hours and hours and never get bored of it. But 10 seconds left. We got killed this match. Unless we make something happen here. But I don't think we can. Get all this ink going here. I do this. And I didn't die at the end. I was just trying to get some points there. But looks like we lost this one. Definitely looks like we lost this one. We had a few kills. The ink strike booth was really cool too. But yeah. We got completely dominated. Completely dominated. Did we level up though? That would be nice if we level up. Would be beautiful if we do level up. Let's make it happen. Make me level up. Make me level up. Because if I level up here, that means I get to go into the shop and get a new weapon and showcase it. And showcase. Because so far we showcased the normal gun, which was the splatter shot. The slosher, which I want to use for one more match, get better with it. We had five kills, three deaths, which isn't too bad. And we did level up. Did level up, which means we can go to the shop and buy a new weapon. So guys, we made our way back to the weapon shop. We're going to be buying a brand new weapon, which is the Tri Stinger. It is a bow and arrow just released in Splatoon 3. I definitely want to try it out, and I definitely want to get good with this. I feel like I want to be a, a either a bow and arrow person or a Splatana person in Splatoon 3. So I'm going to buy that. We're going to try it out in probably the next two battles. How many battles have we played? So two. We've played two battles so far. And we are level four now, which means we can actually head to these shops and buy some new gear. So do we have anything good that I actually want to buy? Probably not, right? I probably don't want to buy anything right now because the gear is kind of trash until you kind of get on to a higher level. So I think I might just save my coins. I might just save my coins. But yo, look at this. Look at this lobster right here. Dude's huge. Dude is huge. But look at these fresh kicks. Look at any of them. Like I said, then nothing's too good here. I don't think I really need new gear until I get some levels up. So we're just going to head back to the lobby. We're going to look to grab ourselves a win with this brand new, uh, what is it? What is that weapon even called? The, uh, the bow and arrow? I, I just call it the bow and arrow, but it's called something else. Just call it something else, but we're just going to run straight up here. We're going to test it out in the, uh, the little lobby as well. Gotta love it. But I think we're going to play two to three more matches, maybe. I already have it connected, but I never used it before. You can charge it like that. And can I hit from there? There's the range. If I can shoot it like this. I think if I charge it, they stick as bombs. Yeah, if I charge it, they stick as bombs. Look at that. Oh, and that's a closer spread. So I can just charge it like this. I can just start spreading bombs on the field, which is pretty sick. And if I'm up close, what do I do? Do I just do this? Yeah, that's pretty cool. If I hit somebody straight on with it, we'll kill. Let me see. I don't know. It can kill. You hit him with all the bullets. That's pretty sick. That's pretty sick. But I really like the fact that you can like rain this down right here. And kind of just like have a rainstorm. I really like this. This is sick. This is sick. Now, what grenade do we have? We have the, uh, the grenade that takes away ink. And then the special over here is going to be this new one, which I don't know how this works. Oh, that's pretty sick. It kind of just do that. It kind of just does its own thing. All right, that's pretty sick. I'm all about it. Let's hop into a match with this thing. Let's get rolling with it. Time to get it going with the bow and arrow in Splatoon 3. I believe this is our third battle for today's video. We won one. We lost one with the slasher. And now we're rolling out with the bow. And I think we're going to be rolling out with the bow probably for the best of the uh, the rest of the video. I think I'm gonna play three more matches. I think five matches is pretty solid. Five three minute matches bring you guys some content because my Pokemon videos are usually like 30 minutes. So this could bring us around the 25 minute mark. Not too bad. I dig it. I dig it. But I'm the bow guy, which means I got ranged weapons here. So I kind of gotta uh, keep my distance and kind of try to keep these guys back. Let's see if I can, you know, just drop some shots here. He already has a special here, which I kind of don't want to mess with. I really don't want to mess with. I'm gonna charge my special. See if we can get some rolling here. We kill this dude. I smoked him. There we go. Nice little kill for jeans here. We got this guy right here. We get another kill here. I couldn't hit him at all. I'll take it. Oh, we get a wipeout. That's nice. We get a wipeout and I'll take an assist there. Not too bad. I had my special. I wish I could have survived. That's all good. We got all this turf over here that needs to be inked up. Don't worry. Jeans got it. Don't worry. Daddy jeans got you guys. I got you guys. But I got to get metal. I can't waste my time turfing up this ink. I really can't. 
Again, I'm the range guy. I got to keep distance and I got to do all this. I'll send my special here. Send a special and get control of this land. There we go. Nice little kill with it. Love it. Love it. Get this over there. Get this over there. I love how much range we get here. Nice, nice, nice. Just got to keep my distance. And I hear an ultra stamp, which is kind of annoying me. It's going to be right over here. And they got him. They're handling it. I'm going to just keep control of this middle. Because if, when you're playing turf war, if you can control the middle, you kind of just win the game. So that's what I'm trying to do with this uh, with this thingy. This bow and arrow, which I love. I can just put shots up there. Dude, I can hit this dude. Oh my god, I sniped him. I nailed him. That was beautiful. Oh, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Who let him behind me? Who let him behind me? That's on you guys. That's on you guys. But yo, the bow and arrow, so much fun to use. So much fun to use. I just picked that dude right in the face. Just nailed him. I'm going to ink up all this. Try to get my special again. And then get back to the middle here. Try to ink up all that. I almost have my special here. I mean my special. Special is just so good. They're so valuable in this game. Put that there. And he's going to actually special me. I'm dead. I, I think I got mine off. I got a little bit off. A little bit. A little bit. But this, wet, this match is definitely coming down the wire. We got to get up there. Let's go, Jeans. Got to grab ourselves a win. Get back in that win column. That winning record column. Be beautiful for us. Oh god, they have so much pressure on me. I cannot kill if they push me here. Here he comes. I hit the back and send this. There we go, that works. We got that rolling. There we go. Big kill by me. Get up here, get this guy. Another kill by me. Let's roll. Now let's take the ink back. Let's take it back with 25 seconds left. Get it all. Get it all, boys. Get it all. We need all this ink. All this ink to win, yo. But that's a big time double kill for me. I picked this dude. Oh, that's a money name. That was a money name by him. He almost got me. Oh, chill on me. This pressure here. Let's go get some ink. Look for the win. We get the win. I think we did. I think my double kill solidified that victory. Let's see how close it is. It looks a lot closer than it is. I feel like. Oh, this is real close. Did we win this? Show me we won this. Oh my. Wow. They beat us by that much. They beat us by that much. That's wild. That is wild. That is definitely wild. But now we're sitting at one and two. We gotta grab ourselves a winner record. We need two wins in the next uh, battles. We need two wins in the next matches. Let's see how we did with this. Let's see how we did. Because I thought I played pretty well. I really did seven kills, three assists. Or th seven kills, three deaths, and three specials. That's pretty good for three minutes in turn four. But you guys know the deal. Time to hop into our second battle with Bo. Grab ourselves our first win with it. Fourth match coming at you guys. You guys know we're sitting at one and two for today's video. So I'm going to strap my teammates on my back. I'm going to carry them to victory because I do not like to have a losing record. I do not like to have it. So we're going to win these back-to-back -back battles. We're going to at least try to win these back-to-back -back battles. But let's roll out here. Pull out my bow and arrow and get eight. Oh, dude, the bow and arrow is so sick. I'm going to definitely be trying to get good with it. Definitely be trying to get good with it. I'm going to roll out here, fire some shots. Let's get after it. So what I want to do is control this middle. Oh, yeah, we already have a dude pushing up here. Back to back. Hey, I'm scared. We kill him. Okay, I'll take an assist. I'll take an assist. I'll take an assist all day. I'm actually gonna send my special this way. Everyone with that. And I see you this way, buddy. I just smoked him. There's a kill. Let's go. This guy, of course, dropped the special. I was about to nail him. I got the back just a little bit because they have an ink storm coming at me. No bueno. No good at all. Can we destroy that thing, please? Bopped him. Oh, what a kill. What a kill. The after bombs just splatter that dude. Sniping out here. I'm sniping out here. Get the pressure here. Hopefully they go that way and I can just put bombs over there. I'm gonna keep spreading bombs that way. Keep on spreading bombs that way. I'm gonna just keep the pressure this way. I'm charging up my special too while doing this. That's really good for us. I see you over here. Bop him. See you later. Can I hit you up there? Oh, I smoked him. Got him too. Yo, we are picking with this thing. Let me send my special here. Drop that. Oh my god, dude. We are killing with this thing. We are bodying people up with this. My shot's on right now. Here, we'll do some damage on that guy. Drop that bomb in there. Loving this thing. Y'all, I'm loving this gun. Can we take this thing out, please? Let's put some uh, bombs in that corner over there. Hey, we got this dude pushing me. Do not like that. I need my special again. You need my special, but they are pushing up on us. I do not like it. Now this way, and they got a lot of people here. I need my teammates back here. They're shooting shots. They're firing. One another kill here. Some bombs on that. 
I'm gonna have my special. I'm kind of just charging, trying to charge that up right now. I'm gonna get my position, but still, once I get the special, we should be chilling here. There we go. Get this. Drop that. Let's fire it. And did we get killed with that? We do. Beautiful. Two kills. I love it. Let's push up. We gotta push up. Time to push up, people. Time to get all this ink back. Time to get all the ink back. Get a nice big double kill. We gotta push up. Let's go. Some big time plays from jeans. Big time plays from jeans. We're sniping right now. We're on the. We're just picking. We actually want to put one of these bombs there. Actually, a really good bomb. It actually uh, stops our ink from recovering. And yo, we got this dude here. Do not like it. Do not like it. Can't kill him. Oh god, no way we're gonna lose this match off that. No way we're gonna lose the match off of a wipeout at the end here. Are you kidding me? No way. I'm dominating out here. And we're gonna lose off of that. Can we kill him, please? Kill him, please. Thank you. Go. Push up. I'm just gonna bypass this dude. Start inking up all this turf. Did we win? Did we win? Did we win? I don't think we won. Which would be awful. Which would be awful because I played out of my mind that match. We lost and I played out of my mind that match. Hurts the soul, man. That's what hurts the soul about Splatoon. Let's see how I did. I was picking. I was doing some good shots, getting some big time kills. Let's see. But now we're one in three, man. Three losses in a row. Hurts the soul. Hurts the soul, but still, yeah, we're playing good. We're playing really nice. Playing really nice. How many kills I have? I had to been pushing seven, eight. Seven, eight in three minutes? Let's see. 11 11 yo i'm bodying with that i'm bodying with that i'm bodying with that but yo we're one and three we got we got it we got to get ourselves a win we got to get ourselves a win i'm gonna hit keep going we're gonna load into our next match and we're gonna look to end this video on a win. final match coming at you guys we have to end this on a win we dominated that last match i legit put my team on my back but it came down to the wire that's usually what happens with splatoon whoever gets the last push in turf four usually wins the match so that's exactly what happened. We dominate there, or at least I dominate it. And then they got that last push. They got that wipeout right at the end, which a special can change the whole thing. And that's exactly what happened. But yeah, let's end this on a victory here. I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go here. And let's uh, keep inking this up because I almost have my special. I really just want to send it. Yep, there we go. And I special this way. And we might be able to pick up a kill here. We do not. We do not. But nobody inked up all this. So, you know, I'm just going to keep inking this up. Shoot this in there. Oh, I was so, dude, I did some mean damage to those guys. I'm loving this. I'm loving this bow and arrow. The bow and arrow is rocking. It's rifling. It's looking really good. We just gotta get up here. They got a they, they got a wipeout. We were all here in the beginning. Wipeouts are huge in this game. Um, it's cool that it says it now because now you know it kind of like tells your team to kind of push up. Should be kill. Yep, got him. And what am I getting hit by? There you go. There was a dude down there. Big time kills. Let's roll. I'll ink up this turf. And of course, this dude right in this corner here. I almost have my special, which I want to send right here. Hit him. And he should be dead soon. Can someone hit him one more time, please? Thank you very much. I was going to say, I just did a ridiculous amount of damage and I did not get the kill. Let's chill up here. This is going to be my spot. My little, my little perch. So I can shoot shots over there this open and see if I can hit him oh they just did a nice ink storm that was a beautiful ink bomb by our team I get some more ink here nice kills nice kills we gotta take position I'm gonna try to pop this dude right here he's got a gallon loaded up I do not like it I almost have my special so I kind of just want to keep distance here until I get my special there we go and now let's pop it send it that way if I can get a kill we keep pressure no kills that sucks so we're sending bombs. What you want, fool? I see you over there. They got a nice, lovely little ink storm. Nice ink storm. But we're controlling really good. Not too many kills here. But still, controlling really well, and I like it. I like how much we're just controlling this match. Chilling me. Look at this control right here. Just keeping them back, holding them back there. And I'm going to put one of these needs right there. Just so they can't really kind of push up and get a bunch of ink recovery. I see this guy. Still up there, buddy? distance oh what you want i see you out there just smoked him i just bodied him i just smoked him with the shot we actually almost have our special again if i can get right now yep we can push this last 20 seconds let's roll let's roll we gotta get up we gotta get up bodied him nice shot body you get a kill let's roll let's roll 
Nice triple kill for Jeets. Did I just win this match for us? Did I just win this match? Did I just do it? Did I just do it at the end there with a last 10 second triple kill? Show it to me. That's got to be blue. That's got to be blue squad all day. Show it to me. Let's go. Let's go. That is how it's done. Big time triple kill. Three snipes at the end there to grab ourselves that win. What a way to finish off today's video. Let's see how we did. Yo, we control that match perfectly. And that's how I want to play with the, uh, the bow and arrow. Just hold that middle, control it. And then when I have a chance to strike like I did at the end, we take it. and Seven kills, one death, four specials. You got to love it. There it is, ladies and gentlemen, five matches of Turf War in today's video. We ended up winning the first match, we ended up winning the fifth match, and we ended up losing the second, third, and fourth. But the second, third, and fourth, we played really good. We got to showcase the slasher and the bow and arrow in both of those, but it just goes to show that Splatoon 3 is a team game. Definitely it's a team game. Can't do it all on your own. But my first impressions of this brand new game is this game is absolutely amazing. If you guys are a fan of the Splatoon series, you guys should definitely buy Splatoon 3. It is definitely probably the best Splatoon out of all of them. And if you are new to Splatoon and skeptical about buying the game, I would highly recommend it. I would highly recommend buying it because the replay value is incredible. You can play it for thousands of hours and never get bored of it. And it is one of the best multiplayers on Nintendo Switch. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know my videos go live. Seriously, you guys rock out. Make sure you spread positive every day, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.